amy at yourlookshome.com and I'd like to tell you about this really special piece. It is an antique Brittany cabinet and it is our item number 25-46. It dates right about 1880, 1890, around in there, and it is completely hand carved in chestnut. Now, um, this is a dark finish, so it does, it is a very dark color. Many of the Brittany pieces do have this very dark finish, and this is one. So if you love dark finished furniture, this might be one for you. Um, but the Brittany style is based on the region of France, the northwest corner, which was originally a Celtic area before the Celts moved on uh, north into the United Kingdom. And so the Brittany style is very ornate. So it's kind of one of those styles, either you love it or you hate it. Um, some people just, it's way over the top, but some people just super love lots of carvings. I personally do. Um, but you find all of these decorations. It's uh, very, very highly carved all the way across the bottom, all the way around the door. Um, here on the columns, you have actually even carved rosettes all on the car on the columns themselves. Um, here across the top, you have spindles and um, a nice hardware there, original hardware. But that really intricate carving comes from that Celtic influence. Uh, if you've ever seen the Book of Kells in Ireland, um, it's very, very ornate around the edges of the pages. So you do have this drawer space here at the top. So gives you space there. Um, but then what's so interesting about this piece is the carvings that are here on the inside of the door. Now, part of the Brittany style is that you often see um, men and women in their daily life. Often it's working. Sometimes it's relaxing at the end of the day. Sometimes they're drinking or dancing, enjoying the moment. And this is one of these um, special times of enjoying the moment. And in fact, I've never seen this style of carving before, uh, so I find it super interesting. We'll come down and look at it. What we have here are the villagers have come together at the end of the day. We have two men here, a man here and a little lady. She's leaning against this brick wall. And behind is a tree, very uh, detailed. You can see the little leaves. And here's a little thatched hut behind. Um, so they're setting the scene. But what are they doing? They're actually playing a game. And um, this is the French game boule, um, very similar to bocce, if you're familiar with the Italian, sort of the same game. So what you do is you have teams, and these gentlemen have their little balls in their hand, and they're throwing the balls. And what you're trying to do is throw your ball to the main ball and get your ball the closest. And then what the people will do is try and knock their competitor's ball actually out of the way. So it really is just a very unusual carving right here. I just love it because it's so detailed and it, it shows that camaraderie, right? People coming together at the end of the day, just enjoying the moment, letting go of all their worries and just focusing on a fun, friendly game. Um, so it really is just a special piece in my opinion. So I'll go ahead and open this for you so you can see the inside. Uh, you do have one shelf and it is not adjustable, but you could always change that if you needed to. Um, this could work as a bedside table. It's a little bit high, but if you have, sometimes you have great big high king beds, um, but could use it in a hallway, um, could even use it in a kitchen for additional storage, wherever you need just a little bit of storage, but a whole lot of character. Um, just a wonderful piece. I just really love this one. Uh, if I can answer any additional questions for you, please feel free to reach out at 803-276-4001. Remember that Eurolux Home does include free shipping within the continental U.S. and some parts of Canada. But let me know what you think uh, about this game of bull or bocce um, and how you would use a cabinet like this in your home in the comments below.